Marcus Conti reporting on the secret, the secret, a little couple of more revelations, a couple more little bits and pieces that confirm Herald Square is where the treasure, the New York treasure, is in fact buried. Oh, damn, more information, more information coming through from people posting and also this, this the brilliant mind of focus, focusing this, this focus, focus. You stare at the picture long enough and you figure it out. Huh? So I just want to, let's just jump in for a second. So in the eye of the, uh, in the, in the, in the shadow of the gray giant, find the arm that extends over the narrow path. Uh, so that's, that's pretty much uh, <clears throat> confirmed in my view. Anyway, so, fuck you. I don't really care what you guys think. So I want to point out. I want to point out this right here. Right? So I got a lot of new information on uh, on this right now. What does it mean, right? See, there's a lot of information here. There's boxes. There's colors. There's a bird. There's imagery, right? But what's really going on in this picture, right? What what was the what was the guy trying to tell us? What was the priest, the guy who buried the treasure, trying to tell us? He was giving us the address. He was giving us the location. Look, right in front of your face, right? Right in front of our faces. This is going to blow you away. You ready for it? Oh, damn. 35th and 34th Street. That's what he's trying to say. All right, look. There's the three, right? Everybody kind of agreed that the three in the wing, you see the three? I'll blow that up for you. You see the three? There it is, three, right? But what does it mean? Three what? Three, three, what? Three, one, two, three, four, five. There's five boxes. One, two, three, four, five boxes. Thirty-five. And one, two, three, four. Thirty-four. Where is Herald Square Park in New York? It's between 35th and 34th Street. Pow, right there, right? There it is, between 35th Street and 34th Street. That's what he was trying to tell us. He was giving us the address. Right? And you see the Empire State Building, how it casts the shadow down at 11 a.m., right? Now, there's another clue in, in the face, right? I'm going to show you the other face, right? There's another clue right here, right, that no one seems to have ever mentioned, at least not in my time, right? See, you see the shadow on her nose, right? There's a shadow there, right? Why? What does it mean, right? It, everything has means something, kind of, right? So... I'll, I'll assume that that confirms the 11 o'clock shadow. At 11 o'clock, remember, if you have, to, you have to watch the other video. It's, I know it's long, but if you watch the whole video, you'll understand that that 11 o'clock, that's when, you, when the statue goes into motion and you hear the noise. But also at 11 o'clock, that's when the shadow hits the park. And also the shadow off her nose is very, very, very consistent with going in this direct, you know, in in the direction, right here, in this kind of direction. So that is that appears to be the eleven o'clock shadow, right? So thirty fifth and thirty fourth Street, right? That's can that's that seems to be that seems to be a solid, a solid tell right there. What else is in this uh, picture? Okay, so there's there's there, but there's more. Wait, but but wait, there's more. So in the what happened in the poem right in the poem hard word in three volumes h right somebody in the in one of the threads pointed this out that the h is the herald right that's that it's herald park right herald park between 35th and 34th right in three volumes that's the herald the the the, the tribune and the herald tribune possibly right so the H, why is it capital? Because it represents the herald, right? The shadow on the face. What else? Island, Isle of B, somebody points it out. Isle of B, right? I said it was the Isle of Bennett, but that's north of the park. But Isle of B is also Broadway. The Isle of Broadway is right up, if you look at the map, we'll look where Broadway is, right? It's right on the north side. Here it is. Broadway, right? So it's north of the map. It's north. Right, if you're standing here by the fountain where the treasure is, and you you look north, north is not straight up. North is this way. Right, Manhattan is not on a north-south plane. It's on kind of a 
you know, a north, uh, northwest and southeast plane. If you look at it, if you actually pull out a compass, you'll notice that. So north, the Isle of, of Broadway, well, you know, the, not the Isle, like the, the Isle, but he's, he's, he's using I-S-L-E, the island of, right? That's the abbreviation for island, but it could also be the Isle, you know, but Broadway, right? So Broadway, his, his headquarters, Bennett. So that's also, that's also a, um, a, a possibility. So, so those, those are just, you know, more, those are just three more, um, three more facts to, uh, to add, uh, to the, to the equation. So now we, we just, what, one last view of it. So in the shadow of the gray giant, find the arm that extends over the slender path that appears to be confirmed that the Empire State Building casts the shadow down over the over right onto her arm. Her arm is extended over the path. In summer, you'll hear a whirling sound. Um, you'll often hear a whirring sound. So you hear it every hour, often. Right? You hear the machinery, the, the contraption of the guys ringing the bell. You also hear the whirring sound, whirring sound coming up from the subway. Cars are abound. It's it's a V. It's a V, right? It's a a traffic V. <clears throat> Although the signs nearby speak of na- Indies native, uh, the natives still speak of him in of hard word, capital H for Harold. You know, make what you want of that. You're already in the park, so we can kind of. I don't I don't know much more to add at this point to that. Take twice as many steps east. Take twice as many east steps as the hour, 22 steps or more from the middle of one branch of the V. All right, so one branch of the V, if you come from here, this is a branch and this is a branch, right, of the V. Because the park is a V, so one branch and another branch. So if you take, if you, ha- you have to take the east side over here, I'm sorry, the west side, because if you if you started over here and walked, you'd be out of the park. So if you start on this this branch of the V and walk east, again it takes you right to the right to the water fountain, and that's where the imagery of the water comes in. Right? You got all this water down below, right? Drips and water, and so the water imagery comes in at the fountain. So, right? So. Look down and see uh, simple roots. Now, the, the debate is that the park has been renovated by Giuliani. Again, I, have, I showed you the plaque. In the other video, you see the plaque where it was, it's confirmed that there was reconstruction in 1999. Now, did they go all the way down and rip out all the trees? No, they don't do that in a renovation, especially in the city. They never rip out trees if it's, unless they're in the way. Right? But if there's big trees growing they don't just come and and oh let's level all the trees and plant new ones that's not how they do it right so the tree the likelihood that 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 priest got the got the cachet in the ground by one of those trees is is likely now did when during the renovation the question becomes during the renovation did they go down more than three and a half feet and and rip out everything that was in there it, it's unlikely right renovation doesn't mean that they you know that they uh they they pull out all the all the as I said all the trees right so so look down simple roots rapacic uh, rhapsodic man soil I don't know an excited man soil right um, or gaze north to the Isle of B we talked about it. Isle of B is Isle of Broadway or Isle of Bennett all right so so there put that in your uh, put that in your pipe and smoke it <laughs> so Marcus Conti reporting.